what Solomon Matlango is happening. And uh, we've kept uh, some of the, the, the designs that were there before. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Let's, let's all work, walk back to our stations. We are running out of time because now we are entering into the, the red lane. Um, can, can, can members of the media, because if you don't distract them uh, from by standing by the, by the tombstone, they'll be able to take pictures. Space. Can members of the media also move? Can we have space at the tombstone so that we can... Leave? Members of the media, we are left with a few minutes. We still have to go to the gravesite of uh, the stalwart Amatha Matangu, the mother to Comrade Solomon Matangu. Thank you very much. We are going to ask those who are, who are old, who have the flowers, where are they? Where, where is the... the where is our comms people? The, the flowers are here, right on okay. the floor. Can somebody so, hold them? So the, the people who will be laying wreath will just uh, take from there. But Uko Nomunus is assisting us there. Uh, because I think the sizes of the wreaths are not the, are not the same. And they will, they will have been briefed which one will be uh, laid by who. Okay, we'll, we'll firstly, firstly call the Matangu family. Together with the executive chairperson of the NYDA, Commissioner Fiso Twin. And as they come, Comrade uh, Deputy Minister Comrade Tabama Guetta must be ready. Comrade Tabama and the ANC chairperson in the region will come together. They must be ready after the family. And when they are done, the deputy executive uh, chairper chairperson, chairwoman of the NYDA will come with the representative of the Women's League. Can they be ready? And they will be followed by uh, the secretary general of the Youth League, and the and the doctor, the beneficiary of the NYDA. Thank you very much. The chair and the family. Thank you very much. Now we are calling the the veteran um, Comrade Tabama Guetta and his protege, Doctor Koji Maepa, sons of Mutatema. The colonizers of our people. <laughs> Thank you very much. Now we are having Umshazi. Now we are having uh, the, the deputy chair of the NYDA and the Women's League uh, representative who are next to you. Beautiful. But very blouse yako. Hey, board member, Sandy the man, my chosen brigade, fire brigade. They will be joined by the board member of the NYDA, Comrade Zandile Majosi. Thank you very much, comrades. Now we are going to have the Secretary General of the Youth League, uh, Comrade Njabulon Zuza, and the doctor, Umsha Zumnyama, Umshopeng Aparat. Thank you very much, comrades. Thank you very much, comrades. Um, now, co comrades, we are going to move very quickly. I want to thank you for, for, for your patience, for arriving on time.
We're going to ask Kubabusha uh, Drek Masangu to come and give us the vote of thanks. Can you hear me? 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 Okay, now we've come to a stage where the wreath laying took place and the family was actually there. We we'll all remember that Solomon Kalushi Masangu was executed. As I was saying, Masangu was executed. Um, he was tried in November 1977. How Solomon and the case lasted for almost a year until 1978 for charges which at the time was said were attacks in Gough Street. Uh, he was charged with two accounts of murder and several charges under the then Terrorism Act. During his court hearing, Masangu pleaded not guilty Those who follow sport on two accounts of murder. But he, however, was sentenced to death by hanging on the 2nd of March 1978. This was the kind of execution that provoked international protest and the condemnation of South Africa's internal policy. We all remember. Well, there you have it. There, our reporter Lehana Zodetsi coming to you from Mamelodi in Pretoria, where the National Youth Development Agency is re-unveiling a mm. revamped, a revamped. Uh, tombstone for yeah. Solomon Makang. Very beautiful. Uh, just looking at the aesthetics of it, it's very beautiful indeed. Uh, so a touching ceremony happening down in Mamelodi in Pretoria. Live visuals day from Pretoria. Well, we're asking you today in terms of our question of the day, what do you, are you going to do in honor of Nelson Mandela as he would have turned 100 years this year?